My name is Victoria Bach. I'm from Milton, Ontario, and I'm a part of Canada's national women's team. I started playing hockey after watching Team Canada play in the 2002 Olympics. And I remember turning to my parents and turned to my dad and I said, dad, like, I want to play hockey. I want to be just like these girls. And I got my first set of gear. And honestly, I fell in love with the game from there. And I never looked back. Every time I got the chance to step on the ice, I just loved it. I just loved the feeling of skating and um, for me, just scoring goals. I think that's something that's so fun and, you know, winning as a team. I love the team atmosphere as well. Getting the chance to see all your friends every time you go to the rink and compete with them and battle with them. I just love the game so much. I started playing hockey at eight years old. I've always dreamed of, you know, winning a gold medal. And I think this gold medal was extra special to get the chance to finally compete and to win a gold medal uh, in, at home in Calgary. It's probably one of my favorite moments of hockey so far. So um, great experience to win the gold and hopefully we can do it again. <laughs> I'm a Mohawk from the Bay of Quinte and my grandmother's always been a huge inspiration to me. I didn't grow up on the reserve but just hearing her stories and you know my, my father as well they have a lot of relatives that still reside in um, Tyndanaga and I think it's really important that you know being Indigenous I think that we're you know learning the culture and for me it's really important as well to educate myself and um, educate others as well. I recently just was actually in Saskatchewan uh, with First Assist, which is uh, run by John Shabbat. It was a really, really cool experience getting the chance to go there. We visited three different reserves and um, got the chance to, you know, chat with the kids and um, skate with the kids and run a clinic. And um, I think that's really important to, you know, give back and reach out and be role models to these young kids. Um, I think we all have different stories and where we come from, and it's really important to share our stories with other people and hope to inspire them. My grandmother actually sadly passed away uh, three years ago now, but it's so important to me to keep learning about my culture, and I know that's something that would be really important to her. Uh, she always told me to work hard and, and follow my dreams, and um, to give back, I think it's something that's uh, very special and important to me.